James Hopkins. Is he a scammer or is he legit? Let's find out. Mr. Fraser, hot yikes, and no, an expat sipping yad dog. Chilling with the local ties, getting our style on. I interview expat and locals with the dope vibes. If you're digging the vids, then click subscribe. Yeah, Mr. Fraser, hot yikes, and no. Watch some fucking Joe Rogan. Ugh. Dude. Josh, Jason, yeah. thank you. Thanks for being here. Try to keep this sucker like a fist from your face. Gentlemen, what's happening? What's up, guys? The Just putting a quick video together this? for any expats, uh, any travelers, fucking people ads. living in a different country shit? who are kind what of looking for want? a way of sustaining fucking a happy, comfortable expat life without trading all of your time for money. Now, if that's you, expat. then I just want you expat. to stick around because I want to share with you yeah. how I'm sustaining a very comfortable, very happy, time-free, independent lifestyle without yeah. trading all of my time for money and without Me? having a job, okay? So, essentially, what I do is I have learned and a marketable skill of digital advertising okay now I essentially run digital adverts wow. for Sounds local awesome. businesses and I don't even I don't own a local business myself or anything I run their advertising and they happily pay me five hundred to two thousand five hundred dollars per I'm month so right. client for it's the pleasure money. of working with me why because they why are you telling me uh, this? my job is to ensure that their business is always full of happy uh, new customers and I decided to teach people how I've done what I've done to kind of see whether or not it was transferable onto other people and the results of some of my students who are expats have been phenomenal okay now if you are in that kind of situation where perhaps yeah. you're, you're teaching online or you're well, teaching, no, or teaching or you're, you're, you're doing a kind it's of me. job that you don't necessarily yeah, like but that you have to do to sustain the lifestyle that you have. If that's you, then I'd like to invite you to a completely free training by clicking the free. link below and registering. And um, joining me for 25, 30 minutes whilst I walk you through well, the business up. model that has achieved, that has transformed my life, but not only my life, for your digital what advertising money is skill, that? okay? So if that interests you, or it's something that you'd like to find yeah. out more about, I'd like to invite more. you to that free training. Click the link below, register, and I'll see you I'll on the inside. I'll see you. Fucking hell, this is life changing. All right guys, so that was just a bit of fun. I'm still wearing the wife beater, uh, still in character. I'm sure you've seen these ads around YouTube and Facebook. Hey, are you an expat living in Thailand? You can make money online. Uh, I'm sure you've seen these ads around and you've wondered what they are. I did the, the work for you, I went through the funnel, I went through this guy's free training and then not so free training and then even a mentor session over zoom which I recorded um, I'm gonna tell you what I think this is uh, what it is all about so uh, listen up so I'm gonna look at this with a bit of a skeptical mind uh, to start with uh, this the video that I watched is one of the video ads he has another one where you see this kind of drone shot of this nice looking house in Thailand so I wondered, is is that a rental? It, it makes out that it's his house that is bought in Thailand. Uh, he doesn't say it, but he makes, you know, that's the idea, he's making it out. Um, did he rent it for that video? Um, or did he rent it for a few months while he was here? That's what it looks like it is. The kind of house in the video, it's about a f maybe five to seven, five to 10 million baht house, something like that. It's like $120,000. Um, so it's not, it doesn't automatically mean he's a millionaire, even if he did buy that house. Um, which would have to be in his wife's name anyway or in his business's name. I asked him about it So I managed to start going through his funnel and I went into his Facebook group in his Facebook group I asked him the question. Let me read the quote here. So I joined so I, I actually messaged a couple people who I thought were involved with this uh, And one of them replied and said hey, yeah, if you want to find out more, I'll put you in the free group um, So uh, he did that you join these kind of culty type groups. I'm not saying it is a cult, but it's got a culty vibe to it. Usually you'll get a welcome message. Hey everybody, welcome Fraser to the club. And then everybody comments like, hey, congratulations for joining. Congratulations for taking action. And then there's that one guy that's like, boom. Anyway, uh, you've seen these things before. Anyway, James Hopkins, uh, the guy behind this uh, commented, hey, what's up? 
and they replied, Hey, your house looks great in your YouTube video. Is that in Chiang Mai? Did you rent there? Uh, were you living in Thailand? I would love to know. I would love to do something similar, get a place with a nice pool and everything. So uh, let's see if he says, no, that's my place. They bought it or if it was a rental. And then he just replies about something totally different. He says, not been in Chiang Mai for a while, man. We go all over in team events and stuff. Just got back from create a co sorry, uh, Crete a couple days ago. Off to Cyprus shortly. COVID's restricting movement a little. A little. Uh, quite a lot. Um, anyway, uh, so we'll be Europe bound this year. It's hot in here. Um, hope to see you jump in, blah, blah, blah. So he did not deny that it was a rental place. Probably was, um, but, he did, but he never confirmed it either. Um, doesn't really mean it's a scam, but uh, a lot of these um, online guru type people uh, will rent out nice cars and houses to make their introduction videos and promo videos and stuff. So I started going through this guy's funnel. Um, before I did that, once I was in this Facebook group, I noticed I've got a lot of uh, mutual friends also in this group, so I thought I'd message them. Although, one of the group rules, I don't message anyone else within the group. Um, don't post a comment like, hey, is this legit? I just wanna know if this is legit or not. Um, if you do that, you'll be instantly banned. Uh, uh, only post positive things. It's the same in all these kind of culty, um, kind of these kind of groups anyway so that's what it was like and uh, after I messaged messaged a couple people their experience with him and I got replies some people said they've had horrible experience wasted lots of money other people said they're making good money now so um, that's that but one of them obviously grasped me up to the admin or to James and he just instantly blocked me and had also booked a call uh, so as you go through the sales funnel, you'll eventually reach a call, uh, a Zoom call, and uh, they canceled it two hours before. Um, so obviously they decided something's up with this guy um, and they didn't do it, but I didn't give up. Um, I went through the process again with a different email and different name and uh, through a, a VPN, a different um, IP address. So uh, his videos basically it's the same sales tactic as, as all, all these kind of gurus. Um, they, they sell you the why first. Uh, they hit you really hard with the why. This is what you can get. Think about the life you can have if you can get all this money. F that's what they want you to really focus and focus and focus, focus on. Not so much the content of the course. So it was like an hour and a half video you made, made me watch through. Uh, an hour and ten minutes of, you know, the... You don't have to be a teacher. You don't have to have your own boss. Da, 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 da. Um, you can travel the world. You can have freedom. Blah, blah, blah. All this stuff. And then 10 minutes. Uh, this is kind of what we do uh, with the, in the course. And this is what you teach you. And this is how you make money for like 10 minutes at the end. And then uh, you book. After that one, you book a call. The call I ended up going on with a woman. I'm going to omit the name and I'm going to blur out the face. So yeah. The, then before having the call, you've got to go for another hour and a half video, which again is about an hour and 15 minutes of um, hitting you really hard, emotional sales tactics, talking about the why, why, what you can have, the lifestyle you can have, blah, blah, blah. And then a good 10, 15 minutes, uh, vague idea of what the project is. So you've got to go for this call if you want to know more. Um, so that's what happens, yeah, and it says, Alongside doing this myself, I have also have a coaching business to help people apply my method too. For those who are invited to work more closely with me and my team. Um, if what he's doing is so, so uh, valuable and, and makes him so much more money, he wouldn't be doing this. It's clear selling the dream makes him far, far more money uh, than being a, a marketing agent. I'll explain what the, what the actual product is soon. Um, and then also on this slide he says, this is invitation only, which is why we have a flawless reputation. Ah, I'll get into the reputation as well. Um, so invitation only, these kind of things, they're just put in there. Basically, anybody who wants to give them money, they'll take your money. Um, but this just tries to make, it, it, they're trying to make you feel special, okay? Um, 
this slide kind of freaked weird me out. Uh, so he puts up a picture of Elon Musk and he says, but I didn't start out like this guy. I had nothing and I I worked for $500 a month in a call center, but then I, I, I worked really hard and I did these new things and then I got rich. Um, un unlike Elon Musk who was born with everything. Um, I think he chose a wrong example there. For those who know e about Elon, he arrived in America pretty young with no real money or education. I think he did have support from a, a slightly wealthy family, but um, he didn't have like a, a huge investment sum to start a business or anything. Uh, he was living in a, a, a small a small room office uh, while he was developing Zip2. So. I don't know what that's all about. Anyway, next slide. Uh, this just shows his bank statement and how much he was making. Maybe it's true, maybe it's not. Uh, it doesn't say where this money's coming from. Is this money coming from your selling your courses or is it coming from your, um, your business? Uh, and another thing, this proves nothing. These are the easiest things to fake in the world. Like anybody can fake a pay PayPal uh, sh screenshot. It's so easy, like a baby can do it. Um, you can do it in paint. You don't even need Photoshop to edit to make a half decent fake. You can do it in paint. He always points to his trust pilot reviews. Trust pilot reviews. Um, so trust pilot can't be trusted. <laughs> uh, you, there was a Channel Four documentary about how easy it is to manipulate uh, trust pilot to make it look good for your company. So that is meaningless. Uh, it absolutely means nothing. Um, so uh, that doesn't help at all. Uh, although that's what he keeps pointing to as his credibility. Uh, but like seriously, Google uh, the Channel 4 documentary about um, Trustpilot. And this guy basically creates a company that doesn't exist and gets like to the top of the ranking of like 10 or 15 different uh, categories. Uh, and then even if people come in later and put in one star reviews, it doesn't make a difference. Uh, you can even flag up one star reviews and get rid of them and stuff. What he's actually selling is basically uh, a course on how to be kind of a digital advertising agent. So you go to maybe a business that may not be computer literate, uh, they don't know how to run ads and manage their websites and things like that. You say, I'll give you a website, I'll give you a, I'll, I'll give you some Facebook ads, some Google ads, I'll send customers to you, you pay me $500 a month to do that. Now that sounds great, but actually doing that is extremely difficult. Um, so uh, I'll talk to you, I'll talk to you about some of uh, the reviews later. Um, but yeah, so that's basically what it does. Uh, another thing is, this is inf you can learn how to do this online. There's tons of courses. If you go on Udemy, where I have my course, which I sell for like ten or fifteen dollars one-time payment um, for online teachers. There's also courses on how to do this, uh, and I'm guessing they're much more comprehensive than even uh, than his course because they rely on actual reviews and not a kind of cult supporting and backing each other up okay so what's the price of this cost uh, at the end of the sales call they gave me the price of 3,800 British pounds sterling that's a lot of money guys um, but this is what pissed me off after they said but it's 2,800 if you buy right now uh, and what's that what that is called is high pressure sales uh, high pressure sales, although it's legal, it's non massively unethical, especially when you're targeting expats who are living in Thailand, they're struggling, maybe they're teachers on 30,000 a month, they're really struggling, and then someone comes with this opportunity, they sell them on the lifestyle, and, and then they come, come in with this price, but if you don't pay today, you have to pay a thousand a thousand pounds more the next day, uh, and if you don't pay and you don't do this, you won't have the lifestyle that you want. And that's that's what the the person in the uh, doing the video was going on about. I uh, know if 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 you pay today, you can have this lifestyle. What's stopping you having the lifestyle and the time freedom that you want and all this kind of stuff? Um, I, I know this kind of sales tactic because I've 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 kind of done it myself when I was in my younger years. I got involved in multi-level marketing, um, and you do the same 
kind of sales tactic. You start with the why. Um, you focus on what, what is the what, what does your uh, client want? What is their why? Uh, and then you really just you really break that down. You go into it. You ask lots of questions, uh, and you make them really think about what they want and what kind of future they want. Uh, and what they want to change from now, and then you bring it into, you give them your solution, which is the product you're gonna sell them, or the service you're gonna sell them, um, uh, and then you give a high pressure sale right at the end. If you don't buy now, it costs you a shitload more. So that's pretty much what his course is. Teach you how to be a, a digital marketing agency and create your own business. Charges you three, 2,800 if you can pay during the sales call of 3,800 after. Now this may change, uh, obviously, maybe the uh, the person selling had some flexibility too. Uh, do you, what do you, what are you getting out of this course? Are you getting a commission? She kind of ra rambled on about, oh, you know, I like to help this guy because, uh, you know, he, he, he helped me and the, 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 and yeah, I kind of get a commission too. Okay, um, and then I asked, because um, I'd already told her how much I earn, my salary, um, because as part of the the warm-up sales process working out my why and my situation she also asked how much do I make a month uh, and I told her and then she she said she's get uh, she does get a commission so I said in the same w way that she did it I said so uh, what does that look like how much is that and then she denied to answer um, can I ask what that looks like the commission <laughs> Come on, I, I told I told you my monthly earnings. <laughs> it's only fair. <laughs> um, but then later I asked, uh, as well as if I join this and get involved, is there also opportunities to refer people and make money that way? And she says yes, there is, and you can earn four hundred pounds and more per referral. So uh, this is another thing. A lot, I think, a lot of people in the big group, the big Facebook group, um, joined maybe didn't make any money with their business uh, and then they're just hanging on trying to bring in other people just to get their investment back uh, and that's why the group can say stay positive too because um, people still want to bring in more people they want to get their investment back and uh, it seems like a mess to me now I am gonna talk about both sides so I did speak to firstly he's got a lot of testimonials from a lot of people uh, and they seem legitimate uh, people who have taken his course and taken his course and successfully uh, set up a business and made it income. I don't know. Uh, so one guy did co uh, message me and I, we went back and forth and he he was super happy with the course and he was making good money and he said he he hasn't made any money through commissions. Um, he's only made money uh, through his business. Um, so let me conclude this video uh, and I'm going to snip things in when I edit. But. Um, <laughs> So what do I think about this uh, this course? I think it's overpriced. It's way too expensive for what it is. Um, it's culty. I don't like these culty kind of things where if you're in this group, you've got to be positive. If you ask the wrong questions, you get kicked out. I, I, if you've got nothing to hide, uh, I've got other friends who have messaged, actually two people said, hey, I messaged the guy, just asking a couple of questions and I was blocked from the group. I messaged a couple of people asking questions about what's going on. I was just instantly blocked. So if you've got nothing to hide, why are you doing that? That's a bit strange. Um, some people have told me they've, well, two people have told me uh, they've succeeded with the course and made money. Now, I don't know if they're telling the truth or if they're in denial, but uh, I'm going to take their word for it and say, yes, they are. Um, but at the same time, I don't think it's worth the price. I think he's using high pressure sales to sell to sell the dream uh, to people who can't afford it. A lot of people will be taking the taking credit card loans out and stuff to pay for this uh, and then possibly maybe not having the skills or not having the, the know-how or not having the kind of work ethic or personality to be able to succeed in it afterwards um, but they just force them into this high pressure sale. Uh, I think that's wrong. Um, I'll link in some Udemy courses uh, that are really really cheap. I'm, I'm not um, I'm not an affiliate or anything um, But just really courses that are really cheap that teach the same thing uh, also 
um, if you just YouTube search how to run Google Ads, how to run Facebook Ads, um, there's tons of videos on YouTube and there's tons of good ones that give you all the information for free. Um, although it is sometimes nice to do a paid course where everything is structured in a nice order and everything, all the information is brought into one place, which is why I like Udemy. Uh, that's why I created my course on Udemy as well. Um, yeah, so uh, I'm gonna end that video there, and I hope that saves some people some money, and uh, maybe someone watched all that and just still decided to buy, and then was successful. Um, all right, so um, if anything I've said today is wrong or negative, if somebody's watching or if James is watching, uh, and you think what I've said is wrong, um, please do comment and below and let me know. Email me. Uh, FraserHatYai at gmail.com uh, and if James is watching and he's really pissed off about this video uh, and he disagrees with my points I'm willing to to do a one-to-one -one interview with you uh, either on my YouTube or on your YouTube and um, yeah we can uh, you can I can answer you can I can answer all your questions and you can answer all mine and uh, maybe uh, maybe you can show me that I'm wrong, or maybe I will show you that you you were wrong and that you're possibly taking advantage of people here in Thailand. All right, guys, have a nice day. Stay safe out there. It's wild, wild, wild west. And uh, drink Leo, the classic one with the metallic bottle. Can't even buy this anymore. Oh, <laughs> 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 yeah, that's what I need.